Edo State Governor Senator Monde Okweolo made an unscheduled visit this Friday to the state-owned media outfit, Edo Broadcasting Service. The managing director of the station, Sulaiman Aladdin, was present to guide the governor around the facilities. After reviewing the available equipment, the MD expressed appreciation for the governor's visit and outlined some of the challenges the station is facing. Our problem here has, uh, as you've seen, first is electricity, sir. Governor Okpeolo, in response, assured that he would take steps to revamp the station and address its challenges. He also encouraged the management to allow the public to freely criticize his administration through the state-owned media platform. We we'll look for a reliable source of energy. But meanwhile, we we'll look at solar power energy. I actually want this place to continue running 24 hours, just as I told you in the secret. I'm also telling you now, criticize me when I'm going wrong, because I'm here to serve Edo people. Also, the governor took time to inspect ongoing road rehabilitation projects across the state and supervised the sitting of drainage system on Upper Mission Extension in Benin Metropolis. In another development, Governor Okweolo announced a new partnership between Edo State Government and an aircraft manufacturing company to begin the assembly of light aircraft in Benin City. The governor made this announcement at the Benin Airport during the launch of the collaboration, which also include the training of Edo citizens in various aviation fields, such as mechanics, piloting, and other related professions. This is a good development for Edo people. I just flew the aircraft, very comfortable. I, when I was campaigning, you remember what I said, that Edo will build Edo? This is the beginning. Yeah, this is marvelous. I'm really happy because good thing bring good thing. I'm a good person. What you just experienced is this is the Jabru J430. It's a light aircraft, and we're going to start assembling it here in Benin City. Also, we will begin to work with secondary schools and technical schools to train mechanics, aircraft mechanics. Uhiyoze Inarume, EIT News, Benin. Oh, <laughs> oh,